like to welcome everybody back to the Independent Investor Channel. This is a, a smaller company, Charbon Hydrogen. It's an exciting company. I'd like to strike up a little bit of a dialogue on it. And instead of getting into a tit for tat on whether or not you think I'm an idiot for taking a position in this company or for whatever reason, it, it doesn't suit your fancy or for whatever reason, you think that the fundamentals don't align with your investment thesis I'd like to invite those comments in the comment section below. I, I think we need to move beyond uh, this idea that somehow because uh, companies are made uh, possible through introduction through YouTube, that that's somehow a negative thing, okay? Uh, I would pose this question to you. Would Charbonne be uh, made available to you or would you have known about Charbonne Hydrogen before sitting down and subjecting yourself to this 10, 15 minute video on a company that I think has extreme promise on a turnaround. Now, I understand that this is a touchy subject for a lot of you guys, okay? But let me remind you, subscribing to the Independent Investor Channel costs you nothing, okay? If you choose to invest nothing in Charbonne Hydrogen, the introduction is free of charge. The opportunity is introduced to you to deliberate one way or the other, whether or not looking at Charbonne Hydrogen, discrediting it, adding it to your watch list, or taking an investment is made possible to you by the very introduction that I provide. Furthermore, the uh, introduction that was provided to me, I'm one of those candidates that probably wouldn't have discovered the prospects of opportunity with Charbonne Hydrogen. Um, perhaps maybe if you were one of those that got in seeing the stock down now close to 85%, I believe that looking at the way this company has traded it, I've monitored it for the last few months, six months, actually, and the stock action, aside from uh, a doubling pop for no particular reason, uh, aside from the fact that there are few shares traded uh, on the company and its market cap at an anemic 5 million really doesn't put this company on a whole lot of people's radar. So therein lies uh, a unique opportunity, okay? I'm not coming in and introducing you to a company that you already know about, like NVIDIA or, or, or GameStop or, or a myriad of other companies that seemingly take all the headlines uh, every single day in the market. Now, with that said, that attention is important and you need share owners to purchase the company to elevate the stock value in the company. Um, is that my intention? Well, here's the thing, guys. <clears throat> when I look at the fundamentals of Charbon and their proposal to build their first facility in Sorrel Trace, Quebec, and I look at their strategic roadmap, I look at their binding agreement with Superior to... Um, buy the green hydrogen from Charbonne and, and deliver it to their would-be customers to meet inevitable mandates that are coming down the pike. Do you believe that green hydrogen is going to be around? Do you believe that green hydrogen is going to be uh, in the discussion uh, down the line when we're talking about reducing carbon emissions for our businesses out there? Um, if you are in the camp to believe that somehow we will continue to just burn fossil fuel inevitably, okay, if you don't want to answer the question one way or the other and you want to continue to stick your head in the sand to the topic, you can do that as well. If you believe that there is a – there's no difference between dirty and green hydrogen, you're uh, severely mistaken in this interpretation. Um, I don't invest in hydrogen. I don't invest in hydrogen fuel cell. I do not invest in hydrogen in general. Charbonne produces green hydrogen, which ensures that the input, the energy used to produce the hydrogen, um, what powers the electrolyzers is actually coming from a green source. That in essence gives you a snapshot of what should perk your interest in taking a, a look at Charbonne for the first time 
maybe look at um, uh, taking a relook in the company for you guys that have potentially ridden the company down or followed it through its poor business missteps. Sharpone would agree with this and, you know, uh, purchasing um, um, uh, hydroelectric opportunities with dams. The, they are looking uh, and going through um, divestiture of those and, and, and engaging in a renewed focus of offering green hydrogen outlining a strategic location uh, across Canada and uh, the Americas here in the U.S. And those strategic locations have strategic benefit to each of them. And that speaks to the solar, wind, and hydro power, the green power that is used to actually produce the green hydrogen in each of these locations. Now, are they all online? No, none of them are, which is why Sorrel Tracy takes the cake for being the most important of these initial initiatives when we're evaluating the Charbonne opportunity. Sorrel Tracy comes online, all bets are off with regard to where this thing could go. We've got an independent research that would put a market cap of value right now, an enterprise value of 60 million in the company. The company currently trades at five million. Uh, I just picked up my shares at uh, 0.05 per share. Um, my share purchases are actually uh, disclosed for you guys in the disclaimer. The transparency is provided for you so you understand that I'm not only a share owner in the company, but I also do uh, advertising for Charbonne on behalf of Charbonne. And those disclaimers are also provided in the description below. You'll understand that there are clear avenues over my responsibility to disclose those things to you. Um, to tell you that I enjoy covering companies that I also invest in, uh, to bring awareness to those companies to you, to not trip and fall and 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 buy these companies outright without doing your homework, rather to provide these as an introduction to a company along a business line that my friends, I, I think we can all agree on is an attractive business line here. Reducing carbon emissions is very, very real. The 40% tax credit that these companies are going to receive from the governments in both Canada and tax incentives here in the US that are forthcoming to incentivize the use of hydrogen in general, but specifically green hydrogen, because those who really have studied this topic understand that dirty hydrogen it is almost just as pollutive as 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 anything else out there. Fossil fuel, um, you know, specifically diesel. Um, I'll leave liquefied natural gas out of the discussion, but the energy input is just as important to the energy output. And if it takes a dirty process to produce the hydrogen, then then what are we talking about here, guys? Charbonne supports that first mover opportunity with their Sorrel Tracy opportunity, binding agreements with Superior Energy, an over $2 billion CAD market cap company that has agreed to take and purchase the product from Charbonne. Once this uh, contract gets exercised, Charbonne has the building permits with Sorrel Tracy in Quebec, and we're just waiting to, um, to, to see the progress of that and the eventual um, onlining of that facility here. And it, it's going to be all bets off at that point um, when we're looking at the ability uh, for Charbonne to duplicate those efforts across their business plan. Um, and execute along starting multiple facilities. I think if you get into the business plan that Charbonne is looking at, the phase in and the addition of their electrolyzers that uh, can really produce the amount of green hydrogen that um, they believe that they can if the uh, ample electrolyzer is made available for Charbonne, I think all bets are off with their ability to penetrate in a small amount the market in Quebec, but more importantly, uh, to define a template for Charbonne to be followed uh, location after location. 
and we will continue to report out on the progress. But for these reasons, I've taken a, a small position, relatively speaking, in the company. It does not mean that you have to as well. Please accept this as education and information. It's enough to subscribe to the channel because as those developments are made uh, uh, through me, uh, you will be quick to uh, be privy to those announcements. So it's important for you to stay tuned to the channel as we cover these companies because a lot can change day to day, month after month. And um, Charbonne promises uh, a lot of developments even contained within 2024. So you're going to want to stay tuned for those developments. Uh, I'll continue to uh, update you on any further positions that I take in Charbonne, but I thought you guys would appreciate this update on the company. Guys, if you enjoy the content, subscribe to the channel, leave your comments at the bottom of the video. Again, the whole idea here isn't to come on and tell me all the reasons why you don't want to, or all the reasons why you do want to. Give me some deeper reasons as to why this isn't something that you are interested in, or some reasons why it, 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 it is something that um, has your attention and why. Uh, striking up a, an intelligent conversation on this will only educate the community in understanding where opportunity lies. And I think no shortage of where we can look, uh, it can lie right here with Charbon Hydrogen uh, and bringing on their first facility of producing green hydrogen. They are in the driver's seat. Uh, looking to take advantage of first mover in the space. And we'll continue to pour, uh, report out on the pro progress, guys. Thank you so much for tuning in and good luck in your investment future. <laughs>